guys and welcome back to another video with call me jesse well i'm gonna make this really short because i don't want to bore you guys with some long ass intros because i don't clearly enjoy them so i don't want to bore anyone who is just like me so can you guys see some difference on me today yes i got my hair cut so yeah i just recently got my hair cut because my hair is really thin i've got really light hair so i just needed a bit of volume because new year new me yeah so and i don't clearly have any resolutions this year because i don't know well are you just like me is it bad to have not have any resolutions mm, i don't even know but yeah clearly my one main resolution would be this year would be oh yeah i know going to the gym and be very consistent that's the only one which i would really think of right now because yoga really need to lose some weight this year like seriously on a serious note guys well this video is not about that so yeah <laughs> well why is this thing making so much sound well it's scary six and a half hours later yeah so this video is just about how i spend my christmas day yes it's a bit late because i went on christmas day so this is the week after christmas um this is the wednesday after christmas so here i am uploading another video and it's just about how i spend my day with my family apart from my mom which is really bad she wasn't there because she had work she was called for work so yeah and yeah, so keep watching guys and i'm wishing you all a happy new year may you all have a blessed year ahead filled with love joy and happiness throughout the year and yeah so keep watching guys and tell me in the comment section if you guys would love this type of videos when i travel around or if you guys love me to do any type of videos that would be really helpful to have some content on my channel and yeah keep watching i hope you guys enjoy the video So yeah guys, this is how um, the London Tower Bridge looks like. This is why we were just going to the Canary Wharf. Um, so yeah, I think it's one of the best days to go around central London, exploring stuff, you know, exploring, going around, seeing places. Because it is one of the best days, because everything's free mostly. I mean in the sense like, um, there is something called Ultra Low Emission Zone, which doesn't operate just on the Christmas day. And it is the best time because <laughs> it operates throughout the whole year, seven days a week and 24 seven. So, and it's just on Christmas day. So next time be smart like me. <laughs> um, so that's, that's when we had gone there. Um, and even the parking will be free most of the time on, on the Christmas day because it's like less crowded and Usually like the parking in like central London areas will be like even an hour like six to seven pounds an hour so it's quite expensive so I think it's the best time. Um so from there we went to actually um the Canary Walk to see the winter lights. I'm gonna show you guys how the winter lights actually look like. Um so we went there to see the Christmas lights initially because they're really quite fancy like it is one of the best thing like we went there and the security guard was like what like why you guys come here for like um i mean it was quite christmasy like as you guys can you guys can see around like this is how it looked like the entire place i mean it is like one of the most beautiful places like even during the day it is like it is having one of the main financial centers of the uk and of the world so you guys can imagine like it is quite like very businessy area and it has really i mean it has got like loads of buildings so it has one of the second tallest buildings in the uk as well so um we just roamed around looking around the place and this is where we were stopped actually by the security guard um it's called actually the winter festival it's not called the christmas lights uh, it's called the winter festival lights and it starts from the 16th of january this year so if you guys want to go around it's, it's really beautiful so you might as well go there
So yeah, right after this, um, after, right after visiting um, East London, we then we came around to the central to see the lights display, because um, everything was free, like I've mentioned to you guys. Um, I mean, Christmas in London is quite really festive. Like, if you go see around the shops, like, and after visiting the lights, you guys should definitely go visit the shops. They're quite Christmassy, and I love the feeling of. December like it's just the entire December and yeah so after that we came to Seven Dials so Seven Dial is one of the um, I mean it's just a small junction road in Covent Garden where all the seven streets converge and lead you to the Covent Center uh, Covent Garden Center so you'd find shops and restaurants of every taste over here in the small area so it's quite beautiful um, and then we went to uh, the Oxford Street. Who doesn't Oxford Street? I mean, it is one of the uh, most Instagrammed street in the world before. And um, yeah, as you can see, like it was so quiet that evening. I mean, if you guys really want to see around, you know, the Christmas lights, roam around, walking around, I think the best time is like just to visit before the crowd, like before, like. Mm, people finish off their work and also you know before the rush hour you can say like because it really gets busy and you can't do anything much even the shops will be so full so I think the best time is like when to go around on the Christmas day like I have how I have done so you get to do the best things and then we headed off to Regent Street it is Regent Street is the first ever street in London um, to have the light you know the light up um, back in 1954 I mean they all like all these streets do like some switch off light event so hopefully I'm gonna go next year so that you guys could see that around how it is like and experience all that with me so yeah and and then lastly we went to Annabelle so we just passed by through that much of like last year I mean and um, this year I'm actually gonna put up a picture for you guys so you guys can see and even the first birthday they go crazy with their decor so Annabelle actually opted for white Christmas this year with some gold ornaments so it seems like you know Annabelle's is a place for the elite people so yeah have we come this far because oh it really means a lot thank you so much for all your support and love um you guys I really I really want to give a camera hug to you all who has shown me immense support throughout this journey so thank you so much for that from the beginning well until now so keep watching guys keep sharing and keep spreading the love um and also if you do enjoy my videos like i've said please do um leave a comment what type of tell me telling me what type of videos you'd love me to do so i would have some content on my channel and don't forget to like share and comment and also don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon so you won't miss out any any videos from me so you'd be notified when i post videos because sometimes i'd be delaying stuff i know i'm really sorry for that but thank you so much for your love and support you guys i love you all and happy new year again hasta la vista